Adapting a traditional endless runner video game and using a raccoon as the protagonist, researchers from the Universidad Carlos III de Madrid, UC3M, and the Complutense University of Madrid, UCM, in its ADHD is a neurodevelopmental disorder with an estimated prevalence of 7.2% in children and adolescents, according to the latest evaluations. It is clinically diagnosed, and this diagnosis is based on the judgment of healthcare professionals using the patient's medical history, often supported by scales completed by caregivers and or teachers. No diagnostic tests have been developed for ADHD to date. In a paper recently published in Brain Sciences, this team of researchers proposed using a video game that children are already familiar with to identify the symptoms of ADHD and evaluate the severity of the lack of attention in each case. In our game, the avatar is a raccoon that has to jump in order to avoid falling into the holes it will encounter on its route, explains David Delgado Gomez, the lead author and professor at the UC3 Megaseconds Department of Statistics. The main benefit of this study is that it allows symptoms of attention deficit to be directly identified, so that the severity of the patient's inattention can be objectively assessed, say the researchers. Therefore, it could be used to supplement the initial diagnosis as well as to assess the evolution of symptoms or even the effectiveness of treatment. There are also other important advantages, such as the fact that each test would only take seven minutes to complete and does not require specific hardware, which reduces its cost significantly. In fact, conventional personal computers, tablets, or mobile devices can be used, allowing remote assessments to be done. Our results indicate that a shorter test may be enough to accurate. This feature makes it particularly attractive in clinical settings where there is a lack of time, the researchers note. A rapid test that allows early diagnosis The study was carried out in collaboration with a group of 32 children, between the ages of 8 and 16, diagnosed with ADHD by the Child and Adolescent Psychiatry Unit in the Psychiatry Department at the Jimenez. As each child was taking the test, supervised by a trained professional, the appropriate caregiver completed the inattention subscale in the Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder and Normal Behavior Symptom Classification Scale, SWAN, which is an inventory of reports from parents and caregivers. In the game, the raccoon has to jump over 180 holes that are grouped into 18 blocks. Each block, the length of the trunk and the speed of the avatar determine the time between stimuli, which is about 1, 5, 2, 5, and 3, 5 seconds, while the width of the hole determines how difficult it is to jump over, in Makalada Panulis explains. Researchers from the Ray Juan Carlos University, the Autonomous University of Madrid, CIBER Mental Health, and the Puerta de Hierro Majada Honda University Hospital, as well as, please support my channel to grow by pressing subscribe button and the bell icon, we will notify you technological news. Thank you.